Welcome to new video. In this video, we are going to do a project using MATLAB where we will use the demo for freehand drawing a irregular shape over a niche so that it can extract, crop it, mask it and if you want you can remove the background of that image. So let us first run and let us see what we are going to achieve. So one pop-up window we have to show and on click on ok we have to give a arrow mark here so that a user can select a picture and based on its selection we have to generate a binary mask and then we have to turn into burned image and we have to mask outside region and we have to mask the inside region and at the end we have to show it as a cropped image also if you want we can turn the background as white and the selected portion as colorful so for that i'll do another video so please subscribe to channel to stay tuned so let us now look into the coding part so to start with First we will close all the command lines and all the variables and then we have to take a workspace and I am finalizing font size as 16 a global variable where I will be using for titling and messaging. So first I am going to read a image hand.jpg so you can choose the image from your files then I am going to store the size of grey image into rows, columns and number of color bands. Then in subplot 2, 3, 1 I am going to show a grey image that is nothing but our input image. Next I am going to give a title and for font size I am going to give 16 that I have declared here. Then I have to write a pop-up message for that I have to use set command that is set function and I have to give the position and get 0 comma screen size. So after that I have to show the message that is nothing but left click and hold to begin drawing and backslash n for new line and whatever message you want to display on a pop up window you can do it with line number 21. Then we have to wait for ok click. So for that we have to use this one and for freehand we have a function from MATLAB I am freehand bracket. So next we have to create a binary for image of our previous photo, previous image which we have chosen as the input. So that we have to just take it from the extension of I am freehand dot create mask. So mask will be created on the uh, drawn part. So the binary mask we have to show in the second image that is nothing but subplot 2 comma 3 comma 2 and we have to give a title and font size similar to the previous one. Now we have to create the number of pixels of binary image and we have to find the area. So whatever drawn area these two are just for information just for informing the user how much pixels has been selected. Next line number 40 we have to get the coordinates of the freehand drawn region uh, for calculation of pixels and cropping the image and whatever size is stored in struct boundaries we have to store it in x and y columns and rows then we have to plot our original image that is nothing but our drawn thing and upon that we have to show the image for burned image we have to just use burn image uh, function and we have to give the color of it then we have to display the mask burn image under subplot 2 comma 3 comma 1 then we have to show the caption title and for black mask image we have to use black mask image and not binary equals to 0 so we will get a mask image and the same mask image we are going to show under subplot 2 comma 3 comma 4 and we are going to give it them title 
then we have to calculate the mean for calculating mean we have a formula mean as a function under that we have to give black mask image and the binary image which we generated then we have to show this showing is nothing but here we are using message and message will be shown as a pop-up window and the same thing i'm going to show in the, the our video demo at the end next now we have to do the same blacken inside the region so whatever the region is selected we have to show that one so we just have to do inside masking for that we have a function called inside mask and we are going to give the binary image which we generated under subplot 2 comma 3 comma 2 so under line 484 we are going to show the inside marks image and at the end we have to crop the image for that we are going to draw top line bottom line for top line we have to take the minimum of x and for bottom line maximum of y similarly for left column we have to use minimum of y for right column we have to use maximum of y so width will be calculated by bottom line minus top line plus y. similarly height will be calculated using right column minus left column plus one as the column starts with zero as a pixel so crop image is nothing but we just have to crop the image that is nothing but our black mask image and these are the parameters so we just have to display the crop image 2 comma 3 comma 6 under crop image and we have to give title so let us now run and just check the working once again so here we get the popper and we select a small part of it and when we select we get the output and, and in the popper window we get a mean value withdrawn message and this is the output which we got if you want to choose just a background and if you don't want a crop image you just want this part of it and the rest of us as white that is nothing but background removal from an image of any image please subscribe to channel i am going to post another video demonstrating how to remove the background or how to remove a background or any other object from a picture